the bus wasn't all that lively. I mean, quite honestly, it makes sense considering prior somebody, a human being that is, was eaten by an apple. How the turntables, bro, I swear to God, I never thought I'd actually say that sentence. But yeah, it kind of makes sense it isn't lively, but this is chapter two. It looks like the uh, destination is J Corp, so I'm kind of curious as to just what they make, because I don't think we know anything about J Corp. I could hear Rodia's occasional quips or Heathcliff's starting pointless quarrels with someone, probably Don, or Sinclair. Wait, 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 hold on. So you really mean to tell me Heathcliff is always looking to start some shit with the little childs we have? Well, I mean, okay, they're probably not children, but like, they kind of look like children. And Ryoshu demanding a source of heat to light her cigarette, having run out of lighter fluid. Amidst the gripes and disorder, Gregor was pr pretty much the only sinner I could rely on to willingly turn the mood around. <sighs> so what, depression, bro? <laughs> He ain't exactly the bringer of joy, the hell you mean turn the mood around? But now he was one of the quietest- oh, okay, okay. He was just staring out through the window, seemingly lost in deep thought. Damn, so fun party we're having here, guys. One thing was for sure. If anyone were to blame for the trashing- or for trashing the mood on the bus, it'd be Virgilius. The road to the Golden Bow was an awfully arduous one putting us on the brink of death, and some past that, several times, not to mention the occasions when we almost ended up unemployed. Yet Virgilius refused to see from our perspective. Given the circumstances, it's only natural for our sinners to be palpably disgruntled. Tired of the silent treatment, Ishmael spoke up. Ah, uh, no. Alright. Bro, he never stops talking that shit, my lord. But he's even smiling about it, you motherfucker. Huh, <laughs> My lord, bro, I swear to god. Yo, does he write down the fucking the ins insults in the book of his? Dear god. Ooh, so we're exploring her past now, okay. So it's her turn in the uh, trauma wheel that is this game. Hmm? Honestly, thinking on it, because he knows everyone's past, like Gregor's and now hers as well, he, it looks like he knows everyone of their past. And it looks like he chose out the location specifically for those people. Just going like, okay, you to here because, you know, Gregor, you know a lot about the insects and shit, so you're going to go to a place about that. It looks like this is relating to her. Hey yo, that sounded like my place, goddamn! Hey yo, J Corp, don't mind if I do. Great, even Roya has gone quiet now. I really want to see this motherfucker's pass. I want to see why the hell he has a revenge baseball bat. I'm not terribly surprised. Bitch ass, this bus don't stop. Hold that shit down, motherfucker. Know your place. The the tear is fucking the bus. Virgilius cheering and then like the 12 uh, and idiots. The, no word the word, idiots. I know they're sinners, but idiots. <laughs> Grumbling, Sharon hit the brakes without warning, sending most of the sinners flying face first into the seats ahead and flinging others off theirs. You know what? I said 12 idiots, but looking at it, I think there's 15 idiots in this bus. I think everyone in this bus is a fucking moron. I was, of course, powerless against the inertia. A cacophony of complaints and shouts erupted. Although I didn't get to hear these sinners' ramblings in clear detail. I'm willing to bet a good half of them were profanities, so maybe I'm better off not knowing. But what the fuck, Date, are you like 12? 
I mean, honestly, the possibility does exist. Motherfucker literally has a clock face. It's kind of hard to tell the um, age of him. Hopefully that isn't racist towards clock people. It's a persecuted group within the city. Hmm. <laughs> So like, stealth? Hey, yo. hey yo, play the Persona 5 music, motherfucker. Hey yo, let's roll the dice. <laughs> Yeah, I'm fucking I'm quite happy with the change of scenery. We go from dark, depressing blood on the walls to gambling. Hell yes, that I am in my element. I'm not addicted to gambling, though. I swear to God. 그럼 그게 특수한 경우였다는 뜻인가요? 이렇게 보면 머리를 굴릴 줄 아는 직원이 없는 것도 아닌데. Wow, he just always harken back to that shit, huh? Hangam开始的，满人技术的应用，就等。刚刚那诺吉诺，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他，他
Heathcliff glared at Ryoshu and insults welling up in his throat, only to then expel a loud sigh. Oh, he's crowing! Aww. He resigned uncharacteristic uncharacteristically, as if he came to the realization that killing her wouldn't solve anything. Oh, they grow up so fast. Heathcliff in the past would have just been like, Dosh! And then we just would have had to hold that. Damn. They grow up so fast. Alright. Explains why we didn't take the buffs. Looks like the back door. Okay, well, that works. I mean, if you say so, all I'm saying is the 12 of us could just blaze ass through like the building and just beat everyone. That, that's all I'm saying, you know? Ah, oh, shit, I don't get to choose between because I would imagine for the dungeon, they are gonna forcibly split me up, maybe? Or maybe it's just out of, or just like purely in the story, that would be the case. Also, the higher ups express concern over our performance. <laughs> I know. You, you didn't need to clarify that one. Bro, he's been shit talking us for the past three hours. Joint operation? Yeah, that worked out so well last time. We only had, um, what, what? Two out of three of the people die, and the last one of the joint operation, the last person who somehow lived, uh, betrayed us. So, hmm, yeah, wonderful. Hmm. Alright. He's just a pure fucking optimist, I swear to God. Hong Lu looked around expecting Foss to bring them forward for introductions any second. Needless to say, no one showed up like he expected. Yeah, evidently. Alright. Well, wave one was done in like one scene. <laughs> I don't even think there's really that much of a reason to show these fights because honestly, we fucking wash these bitches, dog. I swear to God. <laughs> My lord, like, look at this shit. I'll get that ass a beat. Oh, 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 wait, wait for it. Dosh. Hit him with another one. Hit him with another one. Two damage, bitch. What the fuck? And yep, there they go. 16 damage. Apparently that was happening, but whatever. Yeah. Yeah, we just kind of wash them, honestly. Uh, Low morale? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I would imagine. Oh, do I not have auto? I mean... Let's just... Yoink, 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 yoink. Alright, cool. Uh, get this shit done. I think the only reason he lived was because nobody attacked him. I think that's the only reason he lived. Eh, skill issue. As we entered the shop, we were met with the gruff greeting of an old pawnbroker. Fucking blighter? What? Bro, that sounds like a zombie from like Left 4 Dead or some shit. What the fuck? Yo, he just walks into an old person's home. Like, damn, there's a lot of blighters in this area. <laughs> a lot of old bones. Oh, oh, so did he give us a pamphlet before the rampant amount of abuse or after it? Hmm. 
흉에 가까워질수록 본전도 못 건지게 되는 거죠. Right, now you speak my language. 아. Hey. 그러고 보니 우리 집은 아예 점을 보는 사람들을 정식으로 고용하기도 했어요. Hey, that's weird. So I dog I'm keeping on with you. 집을 나오기 직전에 봤던 점에 대복을 뽑았는데 이렇게 다 같이 만날 운명을 암시한 거였나 봐요. I mean, he did get a three-star identity, so you know there is that. 와, 유복한 집에서 신선 노름이나 해왔던 게 당신의 운명이라니. 저도 다음에는 그런 운명으로 태어나길 기도해야겠네요. 난 사양이야. 저런 놈들이 알고 보면 더 더럽게 노는 법이거든. 음, 그럴 수도 있겠네요. 저도 어렸을 때부터 제 동생하고는 같이 놀기 싫었던 것 같아요. That. 맨날 반칙을 쓰면서 심술을 부렸거든요. 아니, 내가 말한 건 그런 뜻이 아니고 다들 좀볼 거야, 말 거야. Jesus Christ. Motherfucker, calm it down there, blighter. A wrist built like fucking twigs. That's seen anyone. Honestly, I was about to talk mad shit for him saying he doesn't see any wealth. Then, you know, honestly, I, I really can't blame him in the fucking slightest, bro. I, I fucking really can't blame him. The pawnbroker glanced over each center with a dubious look until his eyes landed on me. I'm gonna take that as a compliment. I'm not for sale. I'm Unfortunately, neither the sinners nor the pawnbroker were paying for any paying any attention to Foss words. Ah, this gun is from the gym. Oh, the 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 gun is from the gym. Like, 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 honestly, I keep on saying it, but it's just like, just pure and utter disbelief. You have fucking rich boy over there, Foss just speaking to a fucking flaming clock, and then you have Don being an absolute unbridled gremlin. What is this squad? Yeah, yeah. Oh god, he's gonna kill the blighter now. Oh, screw. Dante, Bitch, I'm a clock. The fuck do you want me to do? Amidst the chaos, the most gentle voice softly landed on my ears. Alright, I don't want them on the squad. There's two big reasons behind that. 네, 버스를 운전한 건 제가 아니니까요. 아하, 그래서 이런 시계 인간까지 데리고 다니는 거야? 알람 기능까지는 없었나 보네. 아하하, haven't heard that one before. I mean, surprisingly, I actually don't think I did. The gentle voice was soon followed by one that didn't even attempt to hide their disdain. Come on, that's a little harsh. Let's try to leave better, better first impressions. I know my voice won't be heard by anyone other than the sinners, but I still can't help but get upset at rude remarks. No, yeah. 이번에 황금까지 탈한 작전 말아먹은 애들. I don't want to beat the fuck out of them. 도시에서 손 꼽힌다는 천재가 속한 팀이라길래 주위에서 기대가 많았는데. I cannot wait to watch your ass die, boy. Ooh. We gotta see what happens in the mirror dungeon. Maybe some friendly fire may occur. Who knows? An unfortunate reality, but hey, not one I'm terribly against if you're catching my drift. Heathcliff gave Yi Song a sideways glance, but what he got in response was lukewarm. You know, like, everyone ignores Don. Understandable, by the way. I feel as though we should double that treatment for Yi Song, bro, I swear to God. Bro, you couldn't, you, like, you could have just said, it's still me. 
like three words. Right? I am and have always been whom I match in the mirror. Bitch, who? who why? You could have just said same person. Two words. Yeah. <sighs> Even Heathcliff is broken because of that man. Hey, yo, I ain't gonna complain if it is because that gives me an easy out. 처음부터 목표가 실패인 작전이라니. 작전이라고 부르기도 못하군. 베르길리우스님은 어디 갔죠? 전 그분 얼굴이라도 볼수 있을까 싶어서 작전에 합류하겠다고 한 건데요. Virgilius is like presumably in the bus, but most definitely what he's doing is writing down insults for us, bro. He is already thinking we're gonna fail this shit, and he's just like, all right, all right, what am I gonna call them? All right, okay. Heathcliff, the fucking steroid road rage moron. He's just writing that shit. Fucking I fucking well. <laughs> No. Effie, oh, I fucking knew it. <laughs> now listen, I don't know much about Korean names, but that sounds like a female's name, you fucking bitch. Unless it actually is a female. You know what, knowing Project Moon, there's like a very high possibility it's actually female. I mean, it kind of looks like a male, sounds like a male, but at the same time, Yan exists, you know? Like, like looks like a female, sounds like a female, that turns out it's a dude, so... I, you really can't be terribly confident. Wow, oh, Jesus Christ. He's literally a fucking golden retriever. Hong Lu is the only person on the team welcoming them with total sincerity. He also almost gave a standing ovation. <laughs> a good half of the rest stared at the two with cold eyes and the others wary until introductions were finished. <laughs> Oh then. Also, okay, maybe that motherfucker is a female. I don't. Huh. Shit, this game has got me questioning a lot. Fuck. She's literally talking to us like we're five year olds. The way Saw dragged out that vocal needled me a bit, but I decided not to argue. Even if I did, the ticking of a clock would be all shit here. Yeah, basically, yeah. Yeah,真心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心心
Ting Tang Gang. What the fuck? Ain't no way that shit's actually real. Ain't no way in hell that's actually a gang. Like, please don't tell me it is. I mean, okay. Fair enough. Apparently, par I, apparently, not confirmed. Apparently, the pinky is like the most ruthless of all the hands. Uh, or all the fingers. And I mean, they're literally called the fucking pinky. So I feel as though, you know, there definitely is a difference there, but still. Let's ignore him. Alright. Back to the plan, we'll disguise as the boss of the Ting Tang gang and win that game of chance. Afterwards, we have to go to the underground floors where the golden bow lies. Leading up to the game, we'll use the items and clothing we can find in pawn shops to disguise as our given roles. Enter the casino and wait for the teams on the top floor to win the game. Right, this BGM in the back is going to be hype as hell. That's about it for the outline of this plan, I think. Hey, wait a second. Won't this entire thing fall apart if our player doesn't win entirely? But it's down to chance and I love that shit. Not addicted to gambling though. By pure unbridled chance. Stop. Ah, oh, okay, we're gonna stack the deck in our favor. Good shit. That's just on my stream where RNG works. Let's get it. Hey, well, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a clock. I don't really got eyes. So I think what you said right there, a little bit racist. Not gonna lie. If he mumbled the last part to himself again while casting a sidelong scowl at our group. He's making it painfully obvious he has no faith in us, and honestly, I cannot fully blame him. Well then. Oh my lord, you didn't break out into a, a mysterious poem. What the fuck? You actually just said one word. I did not think it to be humanly possible. Saad and Effie winked at each other. It was a gesture demonstrating that the two were ideal partners, able to tell each other's thoughts just from exchanging glances. Okay, he's going full kiss ass. The pawnbroker's attitude took a sharp turn from disdainful to cow tone. Who <laughs> 나는 이 수가죽으로 만든 장갑이 탐나는데 이걸 샀던 녀석은 아마 패션 센스가 남달랐을 것 같아. 봉투에 적혀 있는 대로 가져가세요. 각자 맡은 역할이 있답니다. 알아요, 알아요. 이부쇼, 내 봉투에는 청소부라고 써져 있는데 뭔가 차고가 있는 것 같소만. <웃음> <웃음> yeah, fuck that spear, bro. Get a fucking mop. 좋아. 돈은 어떻게 지불할 작정이야? 격 떨어지게 예산 걱정을 왜 하는 거야? 이 블랙 카드로는 못 끊는 게 없어. Oh, okay, you want to talk that shit? Alright, I want that necklace in the back. That that uh gong? Yeah, I want that shit. The fortune slips? Oh, don't mind if I do. All that jewelry right there, take that shit. What does like like a human heart in a jar? I don't mind if I do. It's a good meal for tomorrow. 단테, 어떻게 된 거야? 투뿔 고기는 예산 딸려서 못 먹는다며. 수준 이상의 성과를 보이는 부사에겐 회사에서 한도 없는 카드를 준다는 소문이 사실이었군요. Okay, so, so, so they have no faith in us, and because of that, we have no money. Wonderful. Well, everyone was shocked by the proven existence of the fabled black card. 
A loud voice came from outside. Oi, Harbe! Someone who clearly, clearly belongs to a vicious syndicate entered the pawn shop. I think you'll kill him if you shake him down, bro. He looks brittle as fuck. Pleading with an overtly loud voice, the pawnbroker looked at us. In a way, he looked like he was covertly begging us to help him based on his expression. The sinner's attention was naturally drawn to the ongoing row. I bet you ain't playing with me. Yeah, go up against the old man who like wind would fold in two, but do not try and do that shit against me. Do it against Effie though, fuck that bitch. <laughs> Unlike Ishmael, who scotted the goon, Sinclair anxiously glanced over. Yeah, this was the thing of like, if we beat the fuck out of that, that person, they're just gonna send more people against the old man, so I'm in it. Pleased by the sinner choosing to stay away, the goon continued with the extortion. What? Is it really okay to leave them be? Eh. Young Pogi Krasinian, Segana Saka, Kalizan. Grunde, Kugo Rangi Bozi? Oh, so wait, okay, wait. Because of like the way the sprites are, it looks like Gregor is significantly shorter than Wheatus. I don't think that's actually the case, but it's pretty fucking funny. Igusen, Tonbuda Tokatin and Sevaka Tunzeo. Oh, yeah! Oh, I literally just remembered that, yeah. I literally played a J-Corp mod before. I mean, of course, that's not exactly canon, but I'm pretty sure it was based off of canon information because that had to do with locks and shit. That motherfucker definitely dropped out of like elementary school dog, I swear to god. In spite of the opposition, Foss went on with her explanation. Hmm. Wait, wait, hold on. I didn't misread that shit, right? Processing luck into a commodity that could be traded. Huh. That seems like an ass deal for you. Unless that commodity is insane, but like having bad luck constantly? Yeah, Paust. Cannot wait till your ass is dead. Oh, I cannot fucking wait. Saad flapped the documents full of scheduled plans to emphasize that we'd be busy. Wait, uh, not that word. A bad feeling rushing through my head prompted me to count the sinners I could see. Really? That does not align with a certain someone's beliefs. 
and it's one that would severely provoke her, her principles. Ishmael seems to have noticed what I meant and hurriedly looked around. Oh god. Oh god. The fucking gremlin. Oh no, Don. But it was a moment too late. Don Quixote had already sprinted forward and was swinging her lance at the Ting Tanger, who gripped the pawnbroker by the collar. <laughs> Caught competent, uh, completely unaware, the goon was hit right on the head with the blunt side of her lance. Knocked out on the floor in a frisky swing, the fainted goon became the center of attention for all of us inside the pawn shop for a solid minute. <laughs> He just got the motherfucker passed the fuck out and everyone is just like, look of disbelief, utter trauma and fear. Utter fear of the fact that Don is a team member of theirs. <laughs> for one whole minute. Oh. Yeah, I could see why they think we're fucking morons, because we are. Don't give me that look. There's nothing in my abilities to keep her under control. I think we gotta put on a fucking leash dog, I swear to god. I couldn't stop myself from defending my position even when I was aware that my voice wouldn't reach anyone besides the sinners. Oh well, it's not like my defense would have made them look any less baffled towards me if they could hear it. You're welcome. The pawnbroker was the only one chuffed by this turn of events. <laughs> You do not. No, no, no. You quiet down there. And what twisted fucking reality was that moderation? You should have just killed him. I'm gonna keep it 100 with you. We could at the very least have be like, oh yeah, no, he, he died before he got to the pawn shop. Now, now, you, now you having that motherfucker on record being able to go like, oh yeah, that was the gremlin that knocked my ass out. Her proud expression never looked so provoking. Uh huh. So you remembered his words and still leapt forward. Heathcliff, please do the honors. I bash her in with the bat. I hope he is. What the fuck is Euro Diva? Okay, how the hell do you pronounce that shit? Uh, Euro Disco. Oh, yeah, that shit. European Disco. Uh, what is that? Euro Dippy? Kenego, where you okay? Annie, Kuboda. Yeah, yeah, but what, what is that? What is the European disco? Oh, Jesus. Oh, man. Shut the fuck up. Do not radicalize her any more than you currently are. I forgot you existed again. <laughs> I forgot. I keep on forgetting about that motherfucker, bro. He has had like ten lines. No, 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 no. Seven lines in the game. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Ah, He's he's radicalizing Don. Yes. Let's leave now. Don is about to become a fucking freedom fighter. Let's go. It seemed that Grodia deliberately cut off the pawnbroker in a hurry, but I had a little time to think about the implications. The gang member Don had knocked out, began to flinch as though to get back up soon. That's not our fucking problem. Hey, 
머핀과 소보를 했나? 아, 이거 너무 무서운 짓이 많나 보네 놀려있는 게 전당포잖아 얼마든지 대체를 에피랑 소드예요 사람 이름을 yeah. 맛있게 yeah. 만들어주시지는 yeah. 않습니다 yeah. Okay. Down there, muffin. 그리고 놀려있는 게 전당포라는 뜻은 다시 말해 이 소동을 눈치챈 모든 전당포가 곧 문을 닫을 거라는 소리랍니다 <웃음> Did he turn into a fucking cuckoo clock? 바보들한테 일일이 설명하기도 이제 지친다. 얼른 나가자. Right as I try to leave, someone wearing similar thuggish clothes to the one we just knocked out with a face that looked just as rough stormed into the shop. 어이, 영감! 우리 막내 보지 못했... Alright, now we gotta kill two people. 배시라! 이게 다 무슨 일이냐? Uh, the old man, uh, uh, he had the tattoo augmentations much as yourself as well and just knocked that motherfucker out. Totally was not the gremlin with blood streaming from her lance right now. Alright, alright. We did our best to pretend to be innocent customers who just happened to be in the pawn shop at the wrong time. However, in an unfortunate concurrence of events, that goon came back to senses. <laughs> Uh, it was the old man. He doesn't know what he's saying. He's in a state of delirium. Bitch, me? Okay, wait, okay. I thought he was talking about Dante. Okay. The direction that finger was pointed was simply too unambiguous for me to pretend otherwise. Oh, no, it is pointing towards Dante. Are you fucking kidding me? Bro, I'm a clock. How would I glock you? I, I do not have muscles. Plus, there's no point in denying that I was meant by red time. Plus, yeah. Because I'm sure there would be literally no one else matching that description in this entire district. I will fucking end you. What the fuck is a gaffer? Although the pawnbroker switching sides in a heartbeat and the finger pointing clock, slander, or something I wasn't responsible for too, hurt me a little, I was determined to stand firm and have the sinners do the fighting for me. Oh, what? Bro, I, this game has taught me so many new English words, bro. It's like they're actually trying to, to like teach their fan base how to read. The fuck? Mostly because it was clear that we had to run right now. If I kept letting small things bother me, I would be reduced to a pulp sooner rather than later. <laughs> hey, yo. I agree with that shit, homie. Let's yeah. fucking do it. Honestly, that shit seems kind of based on me down with that. We wouldn't have to sedate him, motherfucker. That's all I'm gonna say. Nobody pay her any attention. Hey, that's what I've been saying, motherfucker. Everyone is crazy. Get used to it. I'm trying to. Ishmael looked insulted by this remark and seemed to be thinking of a counter argument, but the Ting Tang goons ain't ar arming themselves were a more pressing matter. Let's just. Let's get out of here first. <laughs>